long, long, long time ago. Hey, there's this king. His name was King Nebulizer. <laughs> Is that right? No. What was his name? Nebuchadnezzar. Nebuchadnezzar? Yeah. It's not Nebulizer. No. I swear that's the way that Bill told me it said. He said that's Nebulizer. That's not Kevin and Ezra. It's my fault. It's your fault. Yeah, it's gotta be his fault because I'm never wrong. At least in my eyes. Okay. There were three dudes. They worked for the king. The king kind of said, you guys are going to, I'm going to give you this job of being provident, the providence guys of Babylon. So if I have, you all said that three times fast. Okay. So, these three guys, three dudes' names was his shack, her shack, and a bungo. <laughs> Well, it's not his, his shack, her shack, and a bungalow? <laughs> what was it? That's what he named him. He changed your names. What's their names? Me shack, me shack. Head 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 because when I tell a story, they're really confusing. So when you're done, you go to Daniel chapter 3 and read how it really is. Okay? So, he was working for these kings. And these three dudes really loved that. But the king, you know, he was all about himself. He was the king dude. He thought a lot of himself. So we had this huge, 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 I think it was 90 by 90 gold statue. It doesn't really say what it was made of, but, I mean, what it was of, but I bet it looked a lot like him. Don't you think? Because, I mean, this guy was all about himself. He did selfies every day. <laughs> he did. You know, you look at the Bible, it says he did selfies every day. Okay. That thing may be loaded. <laughs> so, after he built this big, big statue of somebody or himself, he said, we're going to praise this thing. And he told these guys that worked for him, he says, you come up with a way so everybody will praise that statue. My God. So these guys got together, and he said, they said, well, every time the music plays, there's a bunch of instruments. Go 
to the fiery furnace. Yeah, but I like this one. It reads better. He said, if you don't do what I say, don't bow down to the music.
stand up for my God. I need you to. We need to spread it through. That's what these three guys were doing. They went to a foreign country that didn't even hear about him yet. And they taught him. Taught them people about our God. So just remember, wherever we go and whatever we do, God has got our back. He's behind us every step of the way. So just remember that when you're out in the world. So when you hear the music...